What is up? Bjorn Steinbach again for Adapt Inspire Active Edition. I'm back in Cape Town at my second home, BUC, also home to Sweat 1000. Epic, epic gym with anything you could ever want. Beautiful space and I'm privileged to be able to train here. It also has some of the best views in Cape Town, the iconic lion's head. If you haven't seen it, oh, there it is, the one behind me. So today I'm gonna bring to you guys a 10 exercise circuit. All right, so today what I want us to think about is uh, epoch training. With all the circuits that I've given you, this is a factor, but especially with today's one. Basically what EPOC stands for is excess post-exercise oxygen consumption. That is a fancy way of basically saying afterburn, the amount of oxygen you consume even when you've stopped working out. All right, so today we're doing a 10 exercise circuit with very little rest. One of the best ways to, to increase your EPOC is short rests. You want just enough rest to get your intensity back up to 80% and keep going burning the most amount of calories in the shortest space of time. Wait for it, this one's gonna be tough. for 50 seconds with a 10 second rest and to change the exercise. Beginners, you're gonna be working 30 to 40 seconds on the minute. So if you're working 30 seconds, you're getting a 30 second rest. If you're working 40 seconds, you're getting a 20 second rest, all right? You don't stop till you've finished all 10 exercises. Then you rest for two minutes and you start again. Three rounds of 10 exercises. Get yourself, you don't have to use weights, but if you do have weights, get yourself a medium to heavy weight, something that works for you. You don't want to compromise your form. As I said, we've got to be sharp, working on the minute uh, to really drive that afterburn effect up. All right, so the first exercise we're going to do is called a goblet squat. Take your medium to heavy weight, just on your chest, hold it up so that you're not out here or using your shoulders. You want it on your chest so that the weight is going down the center of your body. Goblet squat, squat all the way down, squeeze up. I like to look up just so that it keeps my back straight and drive through your heels, all right? That's the first one. Second exercise, you're gonna drop down into mountain climbers, right? Important thing, don't let your bum come up. Keep your bum down, lock your stomach in tight and pinch your stomach every time those knees come up. All right? Second one we're gonna do is called the dumbbell swing. You can do it with a kettlebell if you have, but you're gonna drop down, change hands, swing again. My lower back is flat and I'm pushing my hips forward, keeping my chest up. All right, swinging, hip breathing. For that, you're gonna drop down straight away into a push-up rotation. Wide legs, push-up, Rotate, push up, other side, all right? You're gonna stand up, drop both your weights. This one's gonna get tough, getting that heart rate up. This one, we're gonna do jump lunges. Again, if you can't handle the jump lunges, little jump squats, or if you can't do that, speed squats, all right? Again, work within your own range, build yourself up to any of these exercises. You're gonna pick it up, back straight. Again, lower back nice and straight, elbows wide, squeeze your shoulder blades together, control down. Don't compromise your form, all right? After that, you're gonna do a squat, up, deadlift, up. You wanna feel that stretch in your hamstrings? It's okay if your legs are bent, keep your lower back nice and flat. After that, drop down. You're gonna go up, push up, Renegade row. Push up, other side. Second last exercise, lunge with a twist. If you can't do it front, you can do it back lunge with a twist. Up. Always twisting towards that front knee. And 
Last exercise, push press. Slight bend in your knee, push up. The moment your arms come down, push back up. Let's go. All the way to the finish. All right, and that's it. Tough one, three rounds, all 10 exercises. Beginners, you're doing 30 seconds, 30 second rest, or 40 seconds, 20 second rest. Advanced, I want you at 45 seconds, or 50 seconds with a 15 second rest, or a 10 second rest, always working on that minute. Two minute rest in between rounds. This should take you 10 minutes for the exercises, and two rests of two minutes. 34 minutes in total.